With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, our question is a projectile shot at angles of 45 degree above the horizontal strikes a building 30 meter away at a point 15 meter above the point of projection. Find A. Speed of projection B. Magnitude and direction of velocity of a projectile when it strikes the building. So we are given that projectile is shot at an angle of theta equal to 45 degree. So here theta is equal to 45 degree above the horizontal. It strikes the building which is 30 meter away. This is the point of projection and at a distance of 30 meter away there is a building. Projectile is shot at a distance of at a height of 15 meter above the point of projection. We are asked to find out the speed of projection at magnitude and direction of projection. Now let u be the initial speed of projection. Okay. If u is the initial speed of projection, we can uh, take that, we can consider that p is the point on the building where the projectile hits it. Okay. Now taking the point of projection as origin, our coordinates will be equal to coordinates of p will be equal to 30 and 15. We know the equation of trajectory. The equation of trajectory is y equal to x into tan theta minus gx square upon 2u square cos square theta. So we get y is equal to 15 equal to x is 30 into tan 45 degree minus g that is g into x is 30 square upon 2u square into cos square 45 degree. Clear? So on calculating we get we can put the value of g here. Okay, we can substitute here g's value that is 9.8. So on calculating we get 15 u square is equal to 8820. That means u square is equal to 588. So we get u equal to 24.2 meter per second. This is the speed of projection. So we are asked to find out the magnitude and direction of velocity of projectile when it strikes the building. So at point P, okay, let us consider at point P, we have Vx equal to V cos or U cos 45 degree, okay. Vx will be equal to U into cos 45 degree because U will be same as Vx, this will be cos 45 degree. So this will be equal to, Vx will be equal to, it will be equal to Ux, which will be equal to 24.2 into cos of 45 degree, which is equal to 17.11 meter per second. Also we have equation Vy square equal to Uy square plus 2Ay into Sy. This implies v, Vy square equal to Uy square is U square sin theta that is vertical component sin square 45 degree vertical component of velocity plus so in this case it will be minus as Ay will be minus g so minus 2 into g into Sy which is 15 displacement vertical displacement is 15 so we get Vy square equal to 60g into 0 0.5 minus 30g so this implies Vy equal to 0. Now at point P projectile is at its highest point and hence it is moving horizontally.
okay at point p at point p the projectile is at its highest point and hence it is moving horizontally thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today